Yeah, yeah, yeah. What up, what up? What's going on, man? Salute to everybody that's tuning in to the channel. It's your boy, AC, though. We got an action-packed weekend of battle rap, y'all. It's super, super lit right now, man. We got the trenches joint going down. We got rookies versus sophomores. We got the intakes versus the bricks. Oh, my God. Action-packed, man. But let's get into it, man. Shout out to URL. Fresh off homecoming two. You know, the last event of the year, rookies versus sophomores. A lot of people on Twitter and Instagram have been hitting up URL saying, yo, y'all got to put this shit on pay-per-view. Y'all got to let a stream or see this battle in some form or fashion, y'all. Come on. You know what I'm saying? Give us a gift, man. Give us a gift for Christmas, man. Come on, URL. We still haven't had, you know, any news or updates. Um... We, we we know that T-Rex and Chess didn't go down on homecoming. You know, I'm, I'm hearing different things that this battle could potentially be shot as a surprise at rookies versus sophomores. You know, who you know who knows? You know, I'm trying to I got some things going on. I'm trying to I'm trying to see if I can make it, man. I'm gonna try, man. I'm gonna try. But other than less, it's a fire fucking card. And it even just got even better with these new battles that they actually added to the card. But um Let's talk about the new battles that they just added. So, URL, you know, they announced some one-offs. And I think they had a couple one-offs, I think. Uh, yeah, matter of fact, they did. They had J-Love and Lady J. And they still ain't dropped that battle. URL, what's up? They they dropped them things. They ain't even dropped the fucking battle. Yo, URL, y'all got to catch up, bro. Y'all got to catch up. Come on, man. Y'all still got Civil War battles that ain't dropped. Um, The, the one-off battles, those didn't drop yet. We still haven't seen Nitty. And, uh, and, and foots, that battle still ain't like, come on, transparency, transparency, that's all I'm saying, let's stay positive, though. let's stay positive, okay, so let's talk about the new joints, you got T-Top versus Prep, now, from what I understand, these battles are one rounds, or either three rounds, two minutes, you know what I mean, I know Ab, Ab went on live with three Letterman and said that his battle was three rounds, only two minutes, so I'm guessing all of these joints are three rounds, maybe the two on two, I don't know, I don't know. I, I, I can't. I, I can't really because I ain't, nobody really did any promo as far as explaining the one offs and what's the rules and things of that nature. So we kind of just going off the one the one interview. Shout out to three that he did with uh, T Top versus Prep. Um, shout out to T Top. He just had Capo Bravado on final exams. Um, prep battle. I think the prep battle on the band card. I think he did. I can't remember. But um. I, I, I like T-Top. I'm going to take T-Top. I'm going to take T-Top probably in this joint. Two minutes, straight to the point. I, I'm comfortable with T-Top. Uh, Ab versus Snake Eyes. Shout out to Snake Eyes, man. Snake Eyes know how to sell the battle. He know how to pop his shit. Um, Three Letterman had a very interesting uh, interview with Ab. You know, Ab was kind of throwing hints that this is his last hoorah. You know, he, he also elaborated that he's starting his own league. He's also managing three battlers from the 757. Shout out to the whole 757. Jay Breed, and I believe it was two other people. I can't remember what the names were. But I just found that interesting. Like, ah, bro, like, you still have a lot of battles. You still have a lot more work to do. You're just going to take on the responsibility to manage? I don't know. I, I, I don't know. Uh, here, no, there, you know, I just didn't like the body language, you know, just the real nonchalant, yeah, I don't care, you know, it is what it is, I don't really give a fuck, you know, niggas gonna say what they want, da, 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 you know, if I get motivated, then maybe I'll turn up, it just, I don't like that, bro, it don't add no value, excitement to the match, and I feel like that's why you, you're not getting the certain battles, you know, and I'm a three, I'm also three, man, I get it, three, I see what you, child of three, you let him, man, I see what you're doing, three, three, I, I just wish you would have asked him that one question, bro. Why didn't you take the advantage of being a free agent and just being able to battle from platform to platform? Why did you renegotiate with URL? Why didn't you take the opportunity to go to RBE, to battle Big K, to battle Ill Will? Hell, you could have battled Hitman. You could have battled Young Ill. There's so many battles on RBE he could have had, let alone the Chrome. I don't know, man, but you, you're doing, no disrespect to Snake Eyes, but you battling niggas like Snake Eyes, you battling niggas like, uh, who else, who else he, um, he battled True Foe, like, easy niggas, you could walk, I got Av, man, 2-1, maybe 3-0, but 
I don't know. I can't sleep on Snake Eyes. Cause I had Snake Eyes beating Tay Rock, so I can't sleep on that. But uh, yeah, I got I got Snake Eyes two one. Tay Rock and Swervo against Matt Myron and Kitchen Clean. I don't know, man. This is a real weird matchup right here. I understand Tay Rock is uh KM KM. You know he's, he fuck with uh, OSBL. Um, so I know he's really close with you know that whole entire circle. Swervo's definitely doing his thing. He's really been shining as far as with his battles. You know, even from the beginning of the year with the Cortez battle, he had a phenomenal fucking performance. Um, I don't just, I don't know with this two on two. It, it just, I don't know, bro. And Tay Rock, bro, you taking a lot of battles, Rock. But I get it, man. You know, you, you probably towards the end of your career. You know what I'm saying? You don't did every, you don't battled everybody. Mac Myron and Clean. I ain't, I ain't gonna hold you. I ain't really like Mac Myron's performance um early this year. He had that bad battle. I forgot. I think he battled Fonz, and I ain't never seen that nigga since, bro. Clean was supposed to be, he was supposed to battle on Caps' joint. Never showed up. So yeah, I, I got Rock and Swervo. Yeah, I got Rock and Swervo. It was a one round. I just got them winning the battle. Yeah, period. You know what I'm saying? Honestly, you know what I mean? I was cool. Y'all ain't have to add these URL. I was cool with the whole rookies versus sophomores. Let's get into the real shit, okay? Let's get into the real. This is what we here for, okay? We got Hansel versus Mozzie, okay? I'm not gonna hold you, bro. I got Hansel 2-1. Um, Mozzie. I believe you battled KCJ, and that was that that was that was some nasty work. Like she got you the fuck up out of here. So I got hands with taking that. Ease versus Bandit Montana. This is gonna be a fire fucking battle right here. I fuck with Ease. Fire Bandit. I fuck with him heavy. I got Bandit with the 2-1. Um Authentic versus Capo Bravado, bro. I ain't gonna hold you. <laughs> Capo, that's my nigga. You know what I'm saying? I'm low-key biased. That's my nigga. You know what I'm saying? I fuck with Capo Heavy. Authentic, I ain't really, I wasn't really familiar with Son. I went back and did my homework. Ooh, that nigga nice. That nigga nice, bruh. He's nice. You know what I'm saying? I think he just battled, he battled on a traffic six car. I think it was JC, if I'm not mistaken. I don't know, bro. That nigga fire, bro. He's fire. This is going to be a good Capo. Cabo, be careful. You know what I'm saying? Be careful. Yeah, this nigga right here, he... And I like the I like the way y'all selling these, these fights, too. Like, from the promo. You know what I'm saying? The shit talk in the spaces. Like, y'all doing a phenomenal job. That's why I feel like this should be shown on caffeine, bro. It should. But I ain't gonna survive that shit. But I ain't gonna hold you, bro. I got this probably being battle of the night. One of the battles of the night. One of them. Because there's another one I think is gonna be top of. I think this is probably gonna be one of the battles of the night, neck and neck. Um shit. I'm looking at the other choice. I'm bugging. I'm bugging. These next joints probably gonna be all battle of the night. <laughs> I ain't gonna hold you. I'm edging Cabo with Votto 2 1, yo. I'm edging it. I'm edging it. Cabo, this is gonna be a fight, bro. This might this this is gonna be a fight. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. I got Cabo 2 1. Eunice versus Klutz. Yo, I'm not going to hold you, my nigga. Klutz is fire, bro. He's fire. Eunice, stupid fire. You know what I'm saying? Like, damn. If I had bread, bro, I'd be scared, bro. I'd be scared. I'd go hold you. But I ain't going to... Yo, I feel like that hustle battle, I think it really, really... It really, really, like, sharpened Eunice up, bro. You know what I'm saying? Because that battle, when he battled Hansel at the Riot, that's low-key one of the top 10 battles of the year. Like, back and forth. They had bread on the floor, all that. Like, that battle, almost at 100K. That shit right there was fire. I ain't gonna hold you. This this gonna be another one, bro. Possible battle of the night. I gotta be in a very debatable battle. I'm, I'm edging it towards Eunice, bro. I'm gonna give it Eunice 2-1. Foots versus Dice. Jesus, man. God damn, bro. Two of my fucking favorites, bro. Two of my favorites. I fuck with Dice Heavy. Foots. I fuck with Foots, man. Foots is fire. And I feel like Foots has a lot of experience because he's battled a lot. Big names along with, you know, people in his class. But I feel like he's, he's took enough lumps to just... Be in situations to know how to adjust, know how to write for certain opponents. So I feel like he definitely has the up, but I ain't going to hold you, though. Dice, when he battled Real Deal, like, my nigga. He just, like, that was just a cakewalk for him. 
So it's like, I really haven't seen Dice really get tested. I really haven't seen, I ain't seen nigga bleed. But I've seen Foots bleed. And then I've also, I see, that's another thing too. I ain't see Foots versus Nitty. Because I wanted to see that. I still ain't see that battle. And you that's kind of fucked up, bitch. I ain't dropping that battle too, man. I know y'all did some funny style shit with the time frame. But damn, bro. Mm. I don't know, bro. I don't know. I'm leaning towards Dice 2-1. Ah, I got Dice. I, 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 oh shit! I got dice too up, man. I got dice too up. I ain't gonna. Foots might get you. He might get you dice. He might get you the fucking body. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. Foots is fire, bro. He fire. He fire. But I'm gonna ride with. The, I'm gonna ride with the squad. I got dice too one. I got dice too. I'm ride with, I got dice too one. I, for my person, this is main event right here. This is main event right. This is of the rookies versus sophomores. This is box office right here. Wusa versus LaFleur Soul, bro. Who? What are we doing, y'all? Hands down, battle of the night. The best back and forth, bro. This going to be a dog fight. This is going to be a dog fight, bro. Uh, I don't know who going to win. Y'all can shoot me. I don't know. I can't. I can't. Y'all got to let me pass on that one. I can't, bro. Come on, man. Wusa, that's, that's, that's family, bro. That's the team. LaFleur Soul. Fight. Like he's he proved to me that he's nobody. You like you can't like you can't play with that nigga, bro. You cannot. He's dangerous. He's battle tested. He's dangerous, bro. He is dangerous. He had a little like hiccups and shit there. So that's one thing that I could probably take a couple points because he has shown a little consistency throughout a couple of his battles. We'll have certain hiccups. Wusa, I mean, from the couple battles that I've seen, he's pretty much clean. He's pretty clean. So I don't know, bro. But I'm yeah, I, this the one battle I can't call it, bro. I, I can't call this one. I'm very curious to see how this turns out right here, man. Wusa versus LaFleur Soul, man. But there you have it. Rookies versus sophomores. Fire fucking car. Like I said, the final exams was crazy. I, yo, I'm telling you, this, this class right here. Even like the so the sophomores and like the rookies right here, URL, y'all cannot fumble this, bro. Y'all can't, please, URL, please, bro. Do not fumble these niggas, man. These niggas are fire. They, like, majority of them do a great job marking. A lot of the rookies do a great job. You know what I mean? Shout out to Wusa, uh, Capo, Bennett. You know, they do a phenomenal job as far as putting out, you know, uh, videos, you know, talking their shit, the spaces, music. Do a great, great job. I want to see more from Foots and LaFleur Soul and Authentic and uh, Hanzo as well. You know what I'm saying? Um, Klutz, like, y'all sophomore clash. Y'all niggas is fire, but I don't really see a lot of presence from y'all on social media. Like, if y'all do music, I don't see y'all promoting y'all music. Like, y'all need to really step it up on the marketing and the promotion and just being more visual, visual, excuse me, on your social media presence. I feel like the rookies are do a great job. Y'all, yo... Dice ain't even have a fucking Instagram. You know what I'm saying? Dice done made an Instagram. He he he, he active on his on his Twitter. Like that's what I'm talking about. Like, y'all niggas, y'all had the heads up. So I feel like if anything, y'all should be popping y'all shit. Like nigga, we got the wave. And I feel like the rookies got more the wave. They got more the energy. So you know what I mean. If I could just give any constructive criticism, I feel like the sophomores need to do a better job as far as marketing and pushing themselves. Y'all have a lot of big plates. So y'all have. There should be no reason why. You know what I mean? Y'all ain't got some type of merch, some type of song, not song, but project or something out. Come on, man. Y'all got to package that shit together. 2024, man, that's got to be the year to branding, man. Y'all got to do a better job at branding yourselves, bro. Come on. Y'all on the biggest platform. Take advantage of it, bro. Don't follow the rest of these niggas that been here for years and, you know, disgruntled and mad that they at where they at. Like, no, take, take advantage of your opportunity, my nigga. And get out here and interact with these fans. Holler at the bloggers. You know, tap in, give drops. You know what I'm saying? That's why I fuck with, a lot, like, the people that I fuck with. Not just the rookies, even some of the top dogs. You know what I'm saying? It's a couple people that said they was going to get at me, send me drops, and didn't do it. It's cool. You know what I'm saying? Understand, niggas is busy. But the ones that actually took time, send me the drops, you know, tap in with me. You know what I'm saying? Like, answer my, you know, you know my messages and shit. I'm not saying, like, you ain't got to oh, answer. But, you know, just be cordial and, like, communicate with me i really appreciate that and for me it makes me want to champion and see you more successful not saying more of the others but just like i try to reach out you know and get a more understanding and try to like build rapport with battlers but niggas either just 
you know, they they don't do what they say they're going to do or they just not consistent. I don't know. But like I said, rookies versus sophomores, this is a really, really great class. URL, man, I feel like the winners of this particular matchup right here, I feel like a lot of these niggas should be pushed. But 2024, y'all have to really map this shit out right. Do not give these niggas rum nitty geechee gotties straight out the bat. No, build them up. Build them up. I want to see the tournament come back. Like, come on, man. Like, do right by these guys, man. And I'm talking promotion, too. Give them, put they put some of their first rounds and second rounds on YouTube. Like, utilize everything. Not just the app. Utilize everything. That's just my personal opinion, man. But let me know what y'all think in the comments section, man. Subscribe to the channel. Follow me on all social media platforms. At Aces Working. It's your boy. I'm out of here. Peace.